Hey, hey, hey to all my fellow royal fans, welcome back. Today's headline. The Duke of Sussex launched another blistering attack on the royal family in his latest docuseries for Apple TV+. In the five-part documentary titled The Me You Can't See, Harry took aim at the parenting skills of his father and claimed Prince Charles expected his sons to follow in his footsteps and endure with the pressures of royal life. He also accused members of the royal family of total neglect when his wife, Meghan Markle, was experiencing personal struggles and reached out for help. The 36-year-old also revealed he turned to drink and drugs as he tried to come to terms with the death of his mother in later life. The Duke is understood to have asked permission from the Queen in 2018 to produce a series on mental health, but it is claimed the narrative of the program has moved away from what was discussed. Harry, who served a decade in the military, is said to have stressed the program would place an emphasis on raising awareness of mental health, especially in veterans, and did not disclose it would involve intimate details and attacks on the firm. A source close to the palace said the Queen had no idea the royal family would be targeted, and both the monarch and the Prince of Wales are said to be absolutely gobsmacked. The royal insider added the way Harry presented the program idea to the Queen was clearly misleading and it would not have been approved if royals knew it involves a personal attack on his father and the institution. A source told the Daily Mail, Those around the Queen and Prince Charles are absolutely gobsmacked by what has happened. It is a question of trust, and honestly, any of that is hanging by a thread at the moment. No one within the palace circles has anything but sympathy for Harry's trauma and troubled life, but there is upset and discomfort at him sharing it on international television TV. Certainly the intimate details of his hardships paint a very negative picture of his family and upbringing. Many people have a different view though. Harry announced he would be working on a series with Oprah Winfrey in 2019 and highlighting it would focus on the facts, the science and the awareness of mental health. Calls are increasingly growing for Harry to be stripped of his remaining royal links due to his repeated attacks on his family. Do you think his final tie should be stripped after misleading the Queen? The Duke of Dutch, the Duke of and Duchess of Sussex dramatically left their senior royal positions at the end of March. The arrangement was made permanent by the Queen earlier this year, but Harry and Meghan managed to keep their official royal titles. The move has prompted criticisms from many quarters, and it is argued the couple have been chasing and cashing in on their royal status by signing a number of multi-million pound deals, including with Netflix and Spotify. The Queen confirmed Meghan and Harry would not return to the royal fold in February and stripped their royal patronages and military appointments. Yeah, strip them of the Sussex titles and then they can be known as Prince and Princess. Yeah, so much worse. What do you guys think? If you have anything to add, leave a comment, like the video and subscribe to the channel for more royal news. Goodbye for now.